Well, 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 everybody, welcome back, welcome back. Uh, you know, I, I've been in my A for a while here. <laughs> I hope you didn't forget about me, but this is Sharon, right? So I want you to look at my little disclaimer up there and read over it. Take a few seconds to read over that. And then uh, we're going to get back with you with, with the show, but let me uh, introduce my co-host. You know, it's me, Jamal, one and only. Now, just like I said, it's a copyright disclaimer, fair use. So I don't get all in your feelings. Oh. Well, well, I know everybody don't like Tiffany, so I ain't got to worry about too many people not liking it. <laughs> yeah, we're going to talk about old Tiff Till. All right, you have a few seconds to read over that. Then we're going to get into it. Well, like I said, we got a story about old Tiffany Henyard again. I'm going to call him P- Pigeon Yard. Pigeon yard. <laughs> yeah, Tiffany Pigeon yard. Oh, <laughs> Tiffany just just can't stop. Just mm, mm, mm. Now, let's play a little bit of this little meeting they had at the, or oh, I don't know if it's town or it was a park district, where it is, but anyway, let's play it. Dalton trustees and Mayor Tiffany Henyard held a public meeting together, but not at Village Hall here at the Park District due to concerns over safety and violations of the Open Meetings Act. Under the same roof, Dalton trustees gather for a board meeting, and 30 minutes late, Tiffany Henyard arrives to furious residents. This is an embarrassment to Dalton. For the first time in weeks, a quorum, which means the village can finally vote on crucial issues like paying bills with a nearly $3 million deficit as residents confront the mayor who's facing an FBI investigation over spending. You are a clown. We will continue to speak out against wrongdoing. Why won't you step down? Henry tonight moving to hire a new controversial police chief, but that is facing a legal challenge. And today, the self-proclaimed super mayor says she's... So all well, that makeup on thinks she look good. Now, my thing is, you already... People already don't like you. What you all come to a meeting 30 minutes and late for? Because she thinks she's the a star. You go waltz in there 30 minutes late like... I, know I have arrived. Well, she probably had to come off her cocaine high. <laughs> Hey, hey. <laughs> allegedly, allegedly. I mean, <laughs> she just, and she think people going to vote for her again? That's what she seemed to think, but let's play some more so we can get more into it. This message to President-elect <clears throat> Donald Trump. Trump did win, and uh, congratulations again. This is me saying it publicly <clears throat> for our new president of the United States. Inviting Trump to meet with her, Hendricks running for re-election. Uh, Trump don't know nothing or care nothing about Jason you. House, a critic who says small businesses in Dalton suffer under her leadership. Dalton is the only community that in order to get a business license or a liquor license, you need an attorney. Because mm. guess what? Just like Trump, I'm going to come in on a landslide on post seats. No- Tiffany. <laughs> Why? Tiffany freaking retarded. Why would you think Donald Trump or any other politician will want to talk to you? Or care about you. A small town thief. And you think somebody, just because you, you went to the White House for a marriage meeting, now you think you're so important that a president will want to speak with you? Only only president want to speak to you is the CEO of the FBI. <laughs> or the president of hell. <laughs> <laughs> The president of hell, who might that be? <laughs> Say it. <laughs> wow. I mean, this woman is so conceited and arrogant. And delusional. And, and, and she, she going to be running. She going to come in on a landslide. Who going to vote for her? I'm going to go vote for this crooked mouth elf. <laughs> I mean, you can go by your meetings. These people standing up in the meeting, putting you down, calling you clowns and want you to resign, and you think they're going to vote for you? I'm going to vote for those frog eyes. But how can you even think that somebody would, other than your mama? Because she either got mental health issues or she high on cocaine. Well, she could be, could be mentally, both. She could be mentally ill. Yeah, I can, I can see that. You have to to think 
that somebody gonna read or go to vote you back in after you spent all the mm-hmm. town's money. Mm-hmm. You you walks around here doing whatever you want. You living in a woman's house refusing to pay rent, and somebody gonna vote you back in? That's just mm-hmm. like oh oh stupid Kamala. Did all that mess and thought somebody was gonna make her president? <laughs> I, I stay out of politics. Out of that, po- out of that oh, politics. Oh, okay. I stay out of president politics. Oh, did, did I did mm-hmm. I get into politics? Mm-hmm. Yes, you did. Oh well. Anyway, we don't wanna be like Tasha K. And everybody unsubscribe from her channel. Somebody. <laughs> she lost a hundred thousand subscribers. I think. Cause she says I'm about what? Uh, the uh, who she voted for and. She, really? Yeah. She so, lost a hundred thousand. Hundred thousand. So we gonna stay away from there. Wow, people yeah. serious hey, about this hey, stuff. Hey, hey, that's the real law. But anyway, mm-hmm. back to back to uh, give me a call her that. Uh, what's her name? Tiffany. Tiff- yeah. Back to old Tiff- Tiff. Tiffany Cokehead Henyard. And by the way, we got this video from NBC Chicago's. So we ain't trying to steal no white stuff. Trying to give credit. Okay, now what? 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 Um, what is she gonna run on? What has she done to make her stand out as a candidate in the town where somebody want to vote for her? The most corrupt mayor. <laughs> stole she, the most money. <laughs> yeah, stole the most money without going to jail. Uh-huh. I mean, what is she? I I know she gonna talk about bingo night, uh-huh. and she gonna talk about the skating rink. Uh-huh. It's hardly ever open. Which never open mm-hmm. that she want to use it. So what else is she gonna run on? What what else has she done for Dalton? I know mm-hmm. she she paid the street that her mother lived on. Yeah. And uh And that's to say let's go one thing on the landlord. Now if a tenant first thing she says, I want the, the utilities in my name, keep me your name, that's a big red flag. Well, that uh, that woman that owned the house, she's a family friend. Okay, I'm not putting no utilities in my name. No, no she she thought she was doing them a favor. She, she I don't know she trying to stay in with the mayor. You no, know, the mayor the mayor is renting my house. Okay. You know that's a big deal. You know. I guess she thought at least she thought at the time it was a big deal. Now she see it's really not a big deal. For the mayor to be rid in your house, mm-hmm. cause the mayor taking her own time. Who gonna make mm-hmm. a leave? Who gonna make a leave? No, but like I said you can look in her eyes and say something ain't there in her head. Just look at her. It says I'm I mean, crazy. You, you think the police gonna come and uh, evict her? Nope. They ain't gonna. They ain't gonna do it. Well, the sheriff's office had a hard time serving her papers. They had to so, come there to the meeting. Yeah, they had to come to the meeting and do it, cause she. She's like the what character that always disappears all the time? Cat in the head, finding Waldo. Oh wow! <laughs> uh, I I think that's why she always come to meeting late. Yeah. So she I mean, she's trying to hide. She trying to she trying to slip in and slip out without the police knowing she's there. Or, and a process server. Yeah. Yeah, somebody trying to keep up with her. Well, one time he did keep up with her. He saw it right before the meeting started. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Well, let's play some more. Go back. Remember this moment when I last slide and come in for the victory like I always do. Reporting in Dalton, Randy Gyllenhaal, NBC 5 News. She, she is such an idiot. She is a clown. That one was right when she calls her a clown. Yep. I mean, if you think you're going to, you going to see the people hate you. That's now, who going to vote you in? If everybody hate you, who going to vote you in? Well, we, that's one election, but we're going to stay away from he got in. <laughs> People didn't like him. Yeah, but she ain't got nothing to run on. She done stole all the money out of town. She done spent all the money on wigs, weaves, and sandals, and eyelashes. I mean, the town is in a deficit because mm. of her spending. I mean, r- Really? And then you think somebody gonna vote? She thinks she go went on landslide. I mean, <laughs> talking about she got a bunch of flies in her mouth. <laughs> who who gonna slide in and help her win? She already turned on Keith Freeman. 
She, yeah, I mean, she, she tried to blame him for everything. Well, you remember that time she tried to blame her uh, sister for some of the some of the trouble. The one that had to get on the um, one she tried to say the sister spent all the money. Yeah. So mm-hmm. she tried to blame everybody around her. It's everybody's fault. She don't have no credit card. Mm-hmm. She don't spend. It, it, every, well, how did she get? How she spend? Forty thousand dollars at Amazon mm-hmm. if she didn't have a card. And if you're not over the money, how are you creating a budget? If you don't handle the money. Mm-hmm. And how are you uh, paying and uh, spending the money on all these events and stuff going mm-hmm. on if you get don't have no control of the money? <laughs> That's a good question. See, the problem is she's so stupid. She don't have brain cell no more. She got frog tadpoles in her head now. What? She's it's working. <laughs> I mean, she getting away with it. It's working. Yeah. I don't I don't see how it's working, but and evidently, uh, the old black dude is a new lawyer. Uh. She, she running through lawyers like she running through town money because she can't afford to pay him. And let's open this up a little bit. And let's look see who's in the corner. We got old Andrew Holmes right there in the corner. He finally showed up. Wow. Look, I got a little snake in the corner. Wow. <laughs> Waiting to eat some turtle eggs. I, I, how are they paying their bills? How did, where the money coming from? That, that's beyond me. <laughs> it's coming from the citizens. That's where it's coming from. So they didn't probably had to raise some taxes or something to get the, get that that money back in there so they can pay bills. I don't know what their plan is, but in the old one, when she was a trustee, she was trying to find a way to tax the church. Mm-hmm. So her plan was already robbed the town blind. Well, you know, she she also proposed in another meeting to uh, give the people one hundred percent. Tax return on their homes? Yeah, a 2.2 million tax return. Where that money come from? I know she maybe she got something in the backyard somewhere. They already two million in the hole. Now you want to give out two million? I mean, what? Make I, it make I, sense. I think that one was in Thornton. Thornton? Oh. Yeah. Okay, I started saying Dalton. Because we know Dalton ain't got it. <laughs> that, oh, I thought that was in, in Dalton. When she said you will give people that, oh, okay, yeah, that makes that makes sense now. Yeah, Cause we we know old Dawson don't got it. They ain't got nothing. Mm-hmm. Like, no well, I I guess I guess there's not much left to say about old Tiff and her delusional <laughs> plan to to meet with Trump and. And to be reelected on a landslide, I mean. Look, her old dollar store weave got a curl at the end of it again. <laughs> if 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 she is re reelected in Dalton, they deserve everything they get. I mean, why do you want to be re reelected? Because there ain't no money to spend it on. Well, that's probably why she ain't been arrested yet, cause she, she's uh, in office, and you can't arrest them while they're in office. Who knows? You can indict him, but I don't know. Well, I don't know if it works like the president. I don't think it works like the president. I could be wrong. I could be wrong. I could be wrong, but I don't think it works like that. But I I don't know what I don't know what they're trying to do. I don't know why it's taking so long to build build this case against this woman. They got more than enough evidence. More to do than them. enough. I mean, look at look how fast they. Indicted, um, what's the name? Eric Adams in New York? Yeah. Something ain't right. Something not right about this. She paying, she paying somebody off with town money. She's doing something underhandy, sneaky, and dirty. I don't know and who she doing the with. I don't know. She probably doing a little something strange or a piece of change. She's doing something <laughs> to get away with all this corruption. And and she don't seem to gonna stop no time soon. Well, she, I guess she thinks she's like Puff Daddy, but Puff Daddy, they stopped him. Can't stop, won't stop. Well, he stopped now, but he didn't got he did a lot of damage before he was stopped, and that's what she's doing. A lot of damage. 
Well, that's true. Well, like I said, like, share, comment, subscribe. Let us know what you think of Tiffany P Pigeon Yard. Mm. Yep. You you know, stop playing. It's hard out here for a pimp. I I if if you ain't gonna get the cash app, at least like it. At least subscribe. That's free. It's it, free. it ain't gonna cost you nothing. You're not even gonna know you subscribe to it. It ain't gonna cost yeah. you nothing. Ain't nothing yeah. gonna come out of your pocket. Nope. Even if you don't pay your internet bill, you still subscribe to it. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, wow. <laughs> Even if they don't pay the internet bill? Yeah. Well, folks, uh, I'm going to sign out. And, uh, you know, we'll see you next time around. All right. We out.